the development and manufacturing of biologics like monoclonal antibodies are more mature compared to mRNA. While there are similarities that both of these have an upstream process that generates the material and a downstream process that purifies the material to drug substance, DS. The material and process operations are different between the two modalities. Biologic manufacturing uses a cell line that intrinsically selected to produce a specific monoclonal antibody. mRNA manufacturing, on the other hand, requires an orchestrated combination of different materials in an in vitro transcription reaction. In addition, the quality of the linearized DNA template is important in this in vitro transcription reaction, IVT. Linearized DNA derived from fermentation or from a PCR exhibited a heterogeneity in the poly A tail lengths. The length of these poly A tails may affect the stability of the RNA and the function in translation. In vitro transcription of the mRNA uses a unique set of raw material and reagents that are not shared with the other modality. A lot of the material are supplied by a small and narrow list of vendors who primarily work on the research grade material. Hence, procurement of material with a consistent quality for GMP use is challenging, and it's worth noting that a large fraction of the product costs come from the raw material in, during production, especially those where IP rights still exist. So the industry will need to address this issue to improve supply chain robustness as well as lowering the costs.